Philip. Um, I'm the director for International Students Affairs Office of uh, Providence University. Uh, in the next 10 minutes, I'll be showing you a bit of information about uh, Providence University. And our university, Providence University, is based on Taichung. Um, Taichung is now recognized as the uh, second largest city in Taiwan. Um, also, the increasing population of 2.8 million people are gathering in this second largest city. And also, in terms of uh, transportation to Taichung, uh, we have a free bus, shuttle bus, uh, from the, uh, the campus to central London. And also, we have an airport, uh, which will take about 15 minutes from uh, the campus. And uh, from Taipei, the biggest city, to the second largest city, uh, Taipei to Taichung basically will take one hour by high speed rail train. So uh, it's, it's kind of convenient if you care about transportation. And also there are lots of advantages. Uh, if you, you're interested in studying Taichung, uh, the people are friendly here. Uh, the food is cheaper than the biggest city. And also uh, in terms of life, uh, there are lots of uh, convenience stores and then uh, there are many food. Uh, there's a very fulfilled uh, food culture here. And also the weather in comparison with Taipei and in the north and Kaohsiung, the third largest city in the south, uh, well, I think it's the best and it's very suitable for Southeast Asian uh, students. And in terms of job opportunities, uh, there is a very big science park, uh, which is 20 minutes drive away from the campus. Uh, in the central park, there, there are lots of uh, big IT companies and corporations uh, to provide many internship or part-time uh, job opportunities. So based on this city, uh, Providence University has uh, a lot of advantages as well. So to talk, to tell you a bit about the history of Providence University, uh, basically it was established uh, back in 1956 and the founder is a sister from the Catholic Church. And um, she established this uh, university uh, basically to spread out the uh, the idea towards education and also uh, within the campus there are roughly about 12,000 students and roughly about 15% of the 12,000 students are international students uh, they're coming from at least 32 countries all over the world so uh, other than this history um, Providence University provides very good dormitory for students to stay in. Uh, if you come to study for your first year, the dormitory is guaranteed. Uh, it costs only about US uh, $300-$400 per semester. And also, uh, in terms of facilities, there is a very big library that has more than 1,500,000 collections. Uh, also, this library has been voted as the top 10 most uh, most visited uh, libraries. It's very cozy and it's very large, as you can see from the PPT. And also uh, we have a very big stadium. Uh, it's a five-star stadium. You can actually find all kinds of sports and supporting facilities and equipment, uh, including swimming pool or basketball or uh, volleyball or gym all inside the stadium and one of the uh, strong side about Providence University is that we have we have established a very uh, big web globally uh, include more than 700 partner universities and every year uh, before the COVID-19 pandemic we send about 700 students to study abroad from all over the world. 
So uh, talking about exchange internationalization, uh, Providence University is probably one of the best universities in Taiwan. And um, and the key point I think is is here. Please have a look on the slide. Uh, for fully English English top programs, Providence University provides have this following uh, programs. You can see here uh, for undergraduate undergraduate level programs. Uh, we have international programs in computer science, international business administration program, and also global foreign language education. And these three programs are provided for uh, undergraduate program seekers. And also for postgraduate programs, uh, there are five of them. Uh, the first one, Global Master of Business Administration, basically focus on business and marketing and uh, industry development. And we have another three based on our science department, uh, which are food and nutrition, uh, cosmetic science and applied chemistry. Uh, these are the three programs that focus on uh, cultivating and developing talents in the cosmetic or science area. And the last one, uh, science and information engineering program, basically uh, focus on IT uh, software or app development, etc. So these are the programs you can find from our uh, fully English taught uh, design programs. And for the basic admission uh, for Providence University, uh, if you want to apply to join the department taught in English, the requirement for your English uh, is, I think, to the in Indian uh, parents or students is actually is very standard, right? Okay. So uh, the TOEI re requirement is basically five hundred, uh, and then for master level is. By 525. And for your scholarship, um, I think students and parents definitely uh, concerns a lot on this. Uh, for every semester, uh, we have a variety of scholarship provided available for the applicants. Uh, for the first year entry, uh, if you already achieve the English standard that we required, uh, the total tuition fees. Uh, shall be waived. From the second year onwards, uh, for foreign students, you can maintain your grades 80 or above. Uh, the tuition and fees waived scholarship should be continued. So these are the slides basically list out the three different types of scholarships we have. Uh, for the type A scholarship, uh, you'll be 100% tuition waived. For the type B scholarship is basically 75 uh, tuition percent of tuition weight. For the type C scholarship is 15% uh, tuition weight. And then from second year it's basically uh, it basically assessed by uh, the different class rankings the students may, can maintain. And also outside of students uh, professional training in the programs or the leisure times. We also provide uh, free Chinese language learning courses just to support foreign students to learn Mandarin Chinese. Uh, the Chinese language learning center we have is also the biggest one in the middle of Taiwan. And also except the Chinese learning center uh, we also provide different services and consultation sessions for uh, foreign students. And also every department is basically assigned a uh, mentor professor just to support the foreign students everyday life or their uh, different or difficulties when, in their life. The next slide you can see here is basically the estimate of expenses in Taiwan. Uh, it's all measured in per semester, which is about four months. So the on-campus dormitory uh, is it will cost about US dollars three hundred eighty, and then you have other basic fees including health insurance and living expenses. So it won't cost over the 
in US dollar uh, 2000 per semester. So the last thing I want to address that is that Taichung and Providence University probably provides the best environments and education uh, facilities and content to the students. So uh, hopefully I can see you soon in Taichung and Providence University. Thank you.